Yeah, there's no doubt that it's hard to believe that you don't have to do much to make things happen in your physical life. It all happens within you and then your life follows suit because they're one in the same. So when you change your internal environment, your outer environment naturally changes too because they're the same thing. And I'm telling you as someone who's been through my fair share of problems in my life, this is my through line. This is what works. This is what works. So I'll put it as simply as I can. You have to start operating with more integrity. That's all. You don't have to chase things outside of yourself. You don't have to constantly text that person that said, leave me alone because you desperately need their approval. You don't have to go to school if you don't wanna do it. You don't have to do it just to please your family. You don't have to get a job just because you're afraid of not making money. This is how most humans are living because they're masking their pain. They're trying to fix their internal issues by finding an external solution that is not sustainable. It doesn't work. That it doesn't work. So all you have to focus on is increasing your level of integrity. You can use that interchangeably with honesty. Honesty, integrity, when you're honest, you're operating with integrity. And as you start to live with integrity, then you naturally change your outer environment. Okay, I'll give you a very practical example. You're in a friend circle and a lot of your friends talk bad about each other all the time. And that doesn't sit well with you. It makes you uncomfortable. Well, what you'll find is if you start speaking up and you say, hey, let's be kind, then most of those friends will fall away because they weren't your friends to begin with because you went into those friendships without that level of integrity, yeah? So you drew people to you who were similar to you. And then when you start to increase your level of integrity by speaking up, by setting boundaries, by being kind, by being vulnerable, by being honest, then naturally that pushes out everything that was once a match, you see? So you, you have to start operating with more integrity and the universe will take care of your physical life. You're afraid to be yourself at work. You learn that lesson, be yourself at work, and then you will not be at that job anymore because you're gonna push out. So think of your integrity as a very strong energy. When you raise your integrity, your energy gets more powerful. It pushes out what isn't meant for you, okay? I'll give you another example. So you're in a relationship and you're always walking on eggshells. You're afraid to be criticized. You're afraid that your partner's gonna stonewall you or gaslight you. Well, that shows you that you're not living with integrity because you're playing small. You're dimming your light. So as you begin to communicate more and you get more honest about what your needs are, you would quickly find out that that person wasn't for you, that you're now an inconvenience for them. Why? Because they were never going to be a match to you if you had operated with integrity to begin with. And this is where life gets really bendy. <laughs> you know, it's kind of trippy because what is real? What's real is what's here until it's no longer here. What's here is teaching you how to live with more integrity. And as you live that way, then you push out what you once drew into your life. You push out the toxicity, the negativity. All of that goes away because you're not interested or invested in that anymore. You're interested in operating with the utmost integrity. And there, at that level, you find people who are like you. You find partners who are healthy and open and supportive and communicative. You start making money without feeling obligated to make money because you're not feeding into your fears anymore. We all feed into fears, but if you keep feeding into your fears, then you're not believing in love, yes? So you're not in the highest integrity. Do you see what I mean? But when you start to overcome your fears, when you cast your fears out and you only operate within the idea of, I am abundant, I am loved unconditionally by the universe, so I'm gonna do what brings me joy. And within what brings me joy, I'm gonna be in integrity. I'm gonna clean up whatever I need to clean up. I'm gonna course correct whatever I need to course correct. But you should always follow your heart. Don't just go to school because mommy wants you to, because you're going in the wrong direction. You're trying to cover up pain. Do you see what I'm trying to say? So you, you change yourself inside. You start living more honestly, more transparently with everything and everyone. And very naturally, your physical life changes. You didn't have to go out and make the change happen. It happened from within you.